Hey up viewers and viewers, my name is General Red Strategist and welcome back to Surya Being Hunted. This is episode 149 now, and first things first, before going any further, let me just inform you right now that the commentary you're going to hear this episode is not in-game commentary. I've actually recorded this outside of the game for a simple reason. Today I'm not doing a challenge or one of my typical gameplay videos, instead I'm actually doing something that I think I hinted I might do in one of my recent Sir videos. Now, you'll remember that in episode 146 I attempted to kill the landowner. That wasn't very successful, but as part of the challenge I downloaded a mod for Sir, which is known as the Angel mod, and as I may or may not have promised I can't quite remember, for this episode I'm going to do a proper mod spotlight, however, given the way this mod works I may need to zip in and out of the game in order to showcase things. But since I don't have a program that can actually record my screen outside of games, at least I'm unaware of Fraps being able to do that, then I'm going to put this video together by mishmashing some basic gameplay footage, plus maybe some screenshots overlaid from time to time, which have been taken from outside the game. Hence the reason why I'm recording this commentary outside of gameplay. But without further ado, let's get started. So the Angel mod is by Kay Johnston, and you can find it on the Sir You're Being Hunted forums under the sticky thread entitled Sir You're Being Modded. Now, to sum up what this mod is in one sentence, it's basically a very simple inventory, inventory modifying tool. There doesn't seem to be a lot to it, but it can be a good way of changing up the gameplay a little to make things more interesting. Do you want more guns? No problem. Do you want more distraction items? No problem. Or do you want fewer of one of those categories in order to make things really challenging? Not a problem, because the mod enables you to do that as well. Now, this mod can be a little tricky to utilise if you're a complete scrub when it comes to computers, so allow me to give a basic rundown of how it works. Now, you'll need WinRAR for this, as when you get the download file, you'll need to extract it to a directory of your choice. Now, I just uh, extracted it to a folder called Angel Mode, which was located in my Downloads folder. As you can see, there are a number of files in the download, but the most important is the application that is, en uh, that is entitled Angel Mode. Now, of course, before actually going any further here, I should just give you a quick safety note. Uh, official advice from the Sir developers regarding mods is always to make a backup of all of your Sir files. Now, that's the same kind of advice, really, that well, really applies to any mod for any game, whether it be Sir or Minecraft or even perhaps RTCW, because I know that there are mods out there for that game as well. And I've used that, obviously, as an example of a game that I play on my channel. But whatever you're playing, always try to adhere to the safety suggestions obviously just in case your game breaks when you're attempting to run the mod, so keep that in mind. But with the safety tips aside, in order to run the mod, the first thing you need to do is to open your game and you need to create a whole new world. Now obviously make a note of which uh, slot you're putting in, is it slot 1, 2, 3, 4 or 5? So that's important, you've got to make a note of that. So go through all the usual options, you know, set your starting class, customise the islands and even the robot spawn rates if you want to. Uh, that's up to you, doesn't really matter if you do or don't. Then get that map generated. Now, as soon as you're in the map, the first thing you need to do is quit out of it again. This might seem a bit odd, but trust me, it's all part of the process. What you just need to do is get the map generated in order for the mod to be able to work with it. But of course, you can't actually be in the map when you edit it. Now, I don't think it actually matters whether you completely quit out the game or whether you simply quit to the main menu and tab out. It's kind of either slash or. I myself simply quit to the main menu and then tab down and things seem to run okay. But once you're tabbed out you need to navigate to the folder where you extracted all the contents of the mod download and you need to run that application titled Angel Mode. And what it will come up with is a pop-up screen that asks you to browse for a folder. Now, what that's asking for is the folder containing the map you've generated, not the folder where you've extracted Angel Mod or anything like that. So, you need to identify the directory where your Sir copy is installed. Now, since I'm playing Sir on Steam, for me this would be in my C drive. So I would navigate to where Steam is installed, then I go to Steam Apps, then to the common directory. And then once I've found Sir in that directory, I need to go through some subfolders here. So I locate the subfolder Time64, and then the subfolder within that that's entitled S. The S one is important because that's where your save games are located. 
And once you've uh, opened up, obviously, the S folder, you'll see it'll have all your save games, World 1, World 2, World 3, etc, etc. So from there, you just have to select uh, one of the five worlds you want to modify, or the one you've generated or whatever. So select it, and then you press OK. After you've done that, what will then come up is another box. And what this will do is ask you a series of three questions. Number one, how much ammo you'd like. Number two, how many distraction items you'd like. And number three, whether you'd like to start with a bag of guns. So you'll notice as you're navigating through these boxes that for the first two questions, there are multiple options you can choose from, ranging from none to a lot more. And this will basically affect the spawn rates of items that are classed under the ammo and distraction item categories. So, for example, if you were to choose a lot for ammo, then when you return to your world that you've generated and you start looking in some of the inventories of buildings, you'll find more ammo pickups than you would normally find if you were to just generate the world naturally. The bag of guns element is an interesting little addition, um, because if you choose this one, if you choose to say yes that is, what it will do is it will give you a seriously awesome starting kit. Think of the kind of officer starting kit except times 10. Basically this kit consists of a revolver uh, plus ammo, a shotgun plus ammo, a rifle plus ammo, some sticks of dynamite, plenty of bandages, a map and a scanner, and a couple of other things as well. So if all you really want to do in game is just to go on a big robot killing spree, then a bag of guns is definitely what you want. So that's all there really is to the Angel mod. There's not much else for me to say. As I said, it's a very basic mod. You know, there's not a huge amount to it, but it can be quite an interesting little thing to play around with. So thank you to Kay Johnston for making this. It's a nifty piece of work and probably one that I'll be uh, having fun with for some time to come yet. So, but uh, more generally to all you viewers out there, I hope you all enjoyed watching this Sir You're Being Hunted mod spotlight. There are other mods out there for Sir. Sir is not, I mean, you know, compared to other games out there, Sir doesn't have as many mods. In fact, there are actually very few of them. But there are a couple which maybe take my eye. I was looking through the uh, list of them on the Sir You're Being Hunted uh, thread on the forums. And yeah, like I say, there's a couple there which I may take a look at. And if, I, if they work, then I may uh, do some spotlights on them as well. But other than that, before I start to ramble, I hope to see you all in the next episode of Sir, whatever that may be. But other than that, this is General Red signing off. Goodbye. Whoa, Jesus Christ! Holy shit! Fucking hell! Bloody hell, that did like a million damage! This better not be a- Whoa! Shit! No! Oh my fucking god! How many- What? Holy shit!